It is a fixture in English football that carries genuine resonance, no matter who's at home and who's away. In this case, Manchester United are the hosts, Chelsea the visitors, Old Trafford the venue, and it's live on EA TV. And welcome everyone to England's North West. The action soon to get underway here at Old Trafford. I'm Derek Ray, and I'm joined for expert analysis by Stuart Robson. I'm looking forward to bringing you action from the Premier League coming right up. It is Manchester United taking on Chelsea. Well, thanks, Derek. The best coach I've played under would always tell us before kickoff, earn the right to play. If you can win your individual battles, outrun your opponent, eventually you'll get the space to show your ability. I'm sure that's being echoed by the coaches here today. Manchester United have chosen this particular shape. Davi De Gea begins in goal. Marcos Llorente starts alongside Christian Eriksen in the centre of midfield. And the lead striker today is Anthony Martial. Here's the lineup for Chelsea. Aspili Quetta starts with Antonio Rudiger in central defence. Yuri Tiedemans plays with N'Golo Conte in the centre of the park. And so many different ways to configure an attack. In this case, it'll be two men up front. First half underway here at Old Trafford. And Chelsea regaining possession. No space for them here. Plenty of players waiting in the middle. Well, not quite the header he had in mind. And the goalkeeper gobbling that one up. An unforced error, you've got to say. You can't help feeling, when you look at the table, that when you're playing dominant football such as they have been, that they're going to lap the field. Well, there seems to be no stopping them at the moment. They've been by far and away the best team. Unless something drastic happens, I can't see how they let this slip. It's a good-looking ball in behind. Martial, and he might wreak havoc. An early goal. It is the ideal opening. Well, here it is again. And the pace in which they break forward is devastating. It's so hard to defend against. And his movement's so clever. Once he gets onto it, there's only one thought in his head. Smash it as hard as possible. What a good goal. So Chelsea get the game restarted. How will they respond to that goal? Lindelof opportunity in the wide area Martial in the middle well he made great contact with that one but the goalkeeper had his own ideas Havertz and slipped through beautifully Chilwell Excellence to finish that one off. 
Wonderful to have that in your repertoire. Well, here's the replay, and it's a really inviting ball played into the box, begging players to attack it, and the finish is clinical. It just makes it look so easy, doesn't it? So back underway, one goal apiece here. James and Golo Conte Chilwell using all his defensive acumen to cut it out playing with purpose and control oh a perfectly timed pass and he's certainly in the mood for his second. Well, he's certainly looking a threat. He looks so sharp today. Kai Havertz. Here's Chilwell. Tielemans. Here's Tielemans. Chilwell. No real conviction in the challenge. Advantage, Manchester United. Rafinha, Marcos Llorente, an incisive pass, and denied by the keeper, impressive. Well, they're going for the short one. Martial in the middle. Oh, wonderful save. Well, he reacts so quickly there. That's a great save. Well, do you sense it's just a matter of time before they do score, Derek? They've been piling on the pressure now and really should be ahead in this one. Encouraging stuff from United. No spillage from the goalkeeper. Routine. N'Golo Conte. Havertz. And breaking at pace with Menace. Looks as though they might make real progress on the counter attack. Not so. Chelsea throw in here. Lukaku. And a good looking ball. saves of the season from De Gea but he's gone short with it cross could be useful applying vigorous pressure Lukaku he read the situation defensively and did his job could be oh he wasn't ruthless enough in front of goal Keeper has it now. Marcos Llorente. Malasia. And he might be through here. The net is steering him in the face. Well, fantastic reflex action. Just cutting off the supply. Pull the stats back up what we've seen so far. Some good attacking football. Chances for both teams and plenty to enjoy it. Let's hope for more of the same. Superb block. Can they hit on the break? They need to get bodies back. Not enough cut and thrust, but they keep possession. Every pass hitting its target. Lukaku trying to chisel a chance out of it. 
disappointing cross and gobbled up by the keeper. Oh, good save. And just one minute of stoppage time, say the officials. Given away by Manchester United. And that will do it for the first half here at the Theatre of Dreams. Well, Kai Havertz, very difficult to contain in the first half. How would you sum up his performance? Well, they weren't at their best, but with that equaliser, you can see why he's so important to this team. Hopefully they can get more of the ball to him in the second half so he can show us his ability. The second 45 minutes then here at Old Trafford. Chilwell on the ball, Rudiger. Tielemans couldn't find a teammate. Throw in here. Well, let's see what they have in store for them on the break. Werner. Chilwell that's a useful cross a wonderful counter-attacking football just unfortunate that they didn't score well had he scored that would have been a great goal the speed in which they changed from defence to attack was brilliant now well, here's a match coming up on EA TV that I think you're going to want to join us for I'm really looking forward to that. Two entertaining teams in... Must score! And still dangerous. He's blocked it! <laughs> Chilwell. Werner on the offensive Chilwell now delivering that deep cross but at one point on its flight I wondered if the keeper would have difficulties but no problems in the end Werner could go ahead well, didn't seem to be too much in that offside decision Here it is now, a substitution. Lindelof. Given away by Chelsea. Eriksen. Marcos Llorente has it. It's going to be United's free kick. Well, now he's walking on eggshells, you might say. Next time it'll be yellow. Quite the tantalising free kick he was hoping for. Goalkeeper's ball. Won it back. Action from the quarterfinals of the FA Cup coming your way on EA TV. 
It's Chelsea facing Manchester City. Well, Derek, everything to play for in that game. A place in the last four. What a game that should be. It should be really tense. It should be dramatic. And I'm looking forward to it. And the keeper getting across to stop it. Here's a change for Manchester United. Number 14, Christian Eriksen. To be replaced by number 8, Bruno Fernandes. Over it comes. Cleared away comprehensively. Conte. And he keeps going. Opportunity. Well, it might still work out for them. What a genuine opportunity, but it was squandered. Goal kick. Well, they might be piling on the pressure, but they've got to make it count in those situations, that's for sure. And United will switch things around personnel-wise. Into the final 20 minutes. And fed forwards. And the keeper did magnificently. Well, that's just a wonderful save. How did he stop that? Well, they haven't created too much lately, but the fans know this is a chance to take the lead here. Keen to take it short here. And caught by the keeper. It's a fine United move in the making. Rafinha. It's now with Van der Beek. Has eyes for goal! Oh, that is a... And it goes! At the second time of asking, and the keeper feels hung out to dry. Well, here we can see it again. Normally, I'm the first to point the finger at a goalkeeper, but I think it's a good initial save. I'm not sure he could have done much more. Just a bit unfortunate, really, that it dropped to an opponent. What a big moment. in the dying embers will it prove decisive here Pulisic Kai Havertz oh they have it again has eyes for goal well getting in the way superb save time really is of the essence what can they do from this situation And a short corner, let's see. Well, he's given it away. Just ten minutes remaining here. The clock is not on Chelsea's side, but it's not over for them. And Pulisic has it. It could be up for grabs. Threat over for now, it seems.
Well, with the minutes ticking away, United on the cusp of recording a victory in this one. Your assessment of their performance, Stuart? Well, it's been a really good contest, you have to say. But overall, I think they've just about deserved to be in the lead here. Can they now just see this game through for what will be an excellent win? Pulisic. Could be troublesome. Easy meet for the goalkeeper. Rafinha. And a big chunk of added time here. A minimum of five minutes. Juan Bisaka. Here's Rafinha. Ronaldo. Bad challenge. And now it's up to the referee in terms of what to do next. And yellow it is. A booking. Yeah, he was too impatient to win the ball and probably deserved a yellow card. Substitution time it is here. Quite the tantalising free kick he was hoping for. Goalkeeper's ball. Kai Havertz. Pulisic now. The onus is on Chelsea to be positive with time running out. I think Baran was one step ahead of everybody following the cross. And the referee blows for full time. Positives for Manchester United. Three points for them. What did you make of it all? Well, Derek, it was a really tight game, but they were the better side over the 90 minutes and they fully deserved their victory today. Well, a strong contribution from Bruno Fernandes. Interested to know what you made of his performance. Well, he gave them a really hard time, didn't he? His speed of thought was excellent and he took the winning goal so well. He was brilliant today.